one more sum based on area of a triangle a very interesting sum the question is to find the area of a triangle let's read the question and then accordingly we draw the figure there is a triangle given to us whose vertices are 0 minus 1 we name it as point a 2 1 that is point b and 0 3 that is point c we don't need to calculate area of triangle abc for the time being what further they say there are midpoints of each and every side let's mark those midpoints p is a midpoint of side ab second midpoint is q for side bc and third midpoint is r for the side ac i have marked all the three midpoints what next now we need a triangle which is formed by joining these midpoints so let us create that triangle by joining pq qr and pr so which is the triangle formed PQR. Let us calculate area of triangle PQR. But coordinates of PQ and R not given. So first of all, we will have to show the calculation for coordinates of PQ and R. How? By using midpoint formula because there are three midpoints given. So if three midpoints are given and we need to find the coordinates, we have to apply midpoint formula. That is x1 plus x2 upon 2 comma y1 plus y2 upon 2. Let's start with the calculation for point P. Now since P is a midpoint of segment AB, A coordinates are x1, y1 and B coordinates are x2, y2. Therefore, by midpoint formula, it should be P coordinates 0 plus 2 upon 2, comma minus 1 plus 1 upon 2. Simple calculation. How much is 0 plus 2? It is 2 and 2 upon 2 will be 1 comma 0 because minus 1 plus 1 is 0 and 0 divided by any number is also 0. Second, now this time point B is x1 y1 and point C is x2 y2 because Q is a midpoint of segment BC. Second time we are applying midpoint formula. So this should give us 2 plus 0 upon 2 comma 1 plus 3 upon 2 this is nothing but 2 upon 2 1 and 4 upon 2 is 2 so coordinates of q 1 comma 2 third calculation for point r point c is x1 y1 and point a is x2 y2 therefore by midpoint formula r coordinate should be 0 plus 0 upon 2 comma 3 minus 1 upon 2 how much is this? 0, 1. That's the coordinates of point R. Now children, we have calculated P, Q and R. The question is to calculate area of triangle PQR. So let us consider triangle PQR. Coordinates already we have found. So now point P will be X1, Y1. Look at that. Point P is X1, Y1. Point Q is X2, Y2. And point R is X3, Y3. Formula for area of a triangle, we have done it so many times. Let us now show the working. Area of triangle PQR is equal to half into x1. How much is x1? 1. Into bracket y2 minus y3. That should give you 2 minus 1. First product is done. Second, x2. Look at x2. x2 is equal to 1. Bracket y2. 3 minus y1. How much is y3? It is 1 minus 0. Third term is x3. x3 is nothing but 0 into bracket y1 minus y2. That should give you 0 minus 2. After this step, area of triangle PQR is equal to half into bracket. Look at first bracket 2 minus 1. 2 minus 1 is nothing but 1 and 1 into 1 is also 1. Second bracket, 1 minus 0 is 1, again into 1 will be 1. Third bracket, 0 into any number is also 0. So what do we get finally? Half into 2. Half into 2 is nothing but 1. So area of triangle PQR is equal to 1. Now, since we need ratio of area of the smaller triangle and the bigger triangle, smaller triangle we have calculated 1. Now we need to calculate area of the bigger triangle. That is triangle ABC. For ABC, point A is x1, y1. Look at point A, x1, y1. 
point B is x2, y2 and point C is x3, y3. Therefore, area of triangle ABC is equal to half into, let us solve it, x1, x1 is how much? 0, into bracket y2 minus y3, that is 1 minus 3, first product done. Second, x2, how much is x2 in this case? It is 2, so we write 2, bracket y3 minus y1, that is 3 minus of minus 1, which is nothing but 3 plus 1. Third term, it is x3, how much is x3? 0, let's write 0, into bracket y1 minus y2, y1 minus y2 should be minus 1 minus 1. Now when you solve this further, let's see what do we get? Half into 0 into any product is also 0. Second, bracket is 3 plus 1, that is 4, 4 into 2 is 8. Third product, 0 into any bracket is also 0. So what do we get? Half into 8. Half into 8 is nothing but 4, so area of triangle ABC is equal to 4 square units. Finally, we need the ratio. Ratio of area of triangle PQR upon area of triangle ABC. Let's take out the ratio. It is area of triangle PQR upon area of triangle ABC is equal to 1 upon 4. And it is already in the lowest form, so the ratio is 1 is to 4.